Okay. Um, okay. So I gotta give the I gotta give a shout out to to this guy. Tac Tac to Cat. Um, he's the one who showed me this, and I'm gonna try and do this. The only thing I'm doing a little bit different is I'm leaving more space. So he's using a storehouse. So uh, I'll just use an example here. So I, I need to make another one soon. So three storehouses. So you use a storehouse to measure your distances for your, um, how far you're gonna have your roads. And uh, by the way, I love the developer of this game already. I already know he's working on the game because this is like, already acting a little different. Like those micro updates that we don't really see. <laughs> While I'm playing a game, I might listen to a trial or something. But anyway, so instead of going right up against the road here, that would be up against the road to the, to the right. I go one more. Let's get to work. And and then instead of going like right right next to it, I give one, and then I give two spaces. Let's so I couldn't work. do that this morning. One, two. And that's just what I'm preferring to do right now. And all I'm doing right now is just getting my city ready for whatever I'm going to throw at it. And then I put a road. Because, of course, travel better. And then I also do another road. So I just kind of hammer down. Uh, does this get rid of the tree? Let's try this. I'm curious now. No. I gotta chop those trees down for that road to work properly. That's fine. Don't care. So you get the idea. So if I scan out enough, you can see now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to create this picture. And that comes from Tacticat. Um, I hope he's okay with me making a video uh, using his design. Um, you know, he'll if he doesn't like it, he'll send me a thing and I'll take down this video. But this is going to be like the first part, right? So I am going to finish this and then I'm going to start another video with where I'm going to start building homes, where I'm going to start chopping wood, how I'm going to prepare my animals, like being able to gather uh, hides and, and meat and the berries. I'm kind of like, I like that I have double berry here. But I'm wondering, I don't want the road to interfere with the berries. So if you look, I still have 128, which is double. So if you have, uh, it's called, it's a rich zone. So 64 would be if I didn't have a rich zone. Um, since I have a double zone, I can have up to 128. Uh, animals are normal. Right now there's already 17. I'm already anxious to go hunting, but obviously I haven't even finished building my roads or I haven't even built a house. I haven't done anything. Just so you know, I haven't done any gameplay whatsoever. I haven't told anybody to do anything yet. I'm just building the road system. And then uh, I'm gonna put a chopper somewhere. Don't know exactly what I'm gonna do yet. Uh, but we're gonna put that road system up first and then we're gonna see how, how, that, how we can use that to our advantage. All right. All right, so when I do a new video, I am going to keep it on the normal speed. I want to see what's going on. I want to see what's happening. I want to see what they're doing so that I can learn exactly uh, how people are behaving in this game. So what I did was I built a storehouse here and a greenery here because, of course, I need to get this stuff off the ground. Um, I'm not really happy with how far they got to go. I would have rather maybe put my storehouse near here so they could have done it quicker. But you know what? I'm not uh, picky. I want a long-term thing. So I'm trying to use tack design, and uh, I want to see if it'll work. Uh, I'm thinking that I might want to put a road here. Anyway, we're going to watch our people roam around and see what they do. We need to get this, these resources off the ground as soon as possible, or at least before they uh, deteriorate. These, these logs will never deteriorate, apparently, so we won't worry about that. But i got to get this other stuff off the ground. This, these resources are what will keep me alive for like this almost a whole year. Right, 
so we start with, uh, we're learning Buddhist and Buddhist and Kikami. So right now I have four months worth of supplies. Four months worth of food. And right now fuel, I don't have any buildings that need it. That'll be a winter thing, so I'm not worried about that. Every time I start doing a video, I get the headlines. And that's just the way it is. Um, I do have wide roads, but you know what? I'm not afraid to put a road down to make this quicker, I'll be, I'll be honest. Because you can always delete roads after. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to do this. I'm going to do this. going to be the same way. This is the storehouse. For now, I'm just putting the road down there. I'm just putting the road down there. That's a road that I will be deleting. So the fun thing is, you know what? Choose a row, boys. Just don't go around. Just don't, just don't go all the way around. Um, all four of those rows will be deleted. Uh, this is the beginning of the game. This is how it works. I just want my, my boys to go this way. Yeah, I am playing in normal speed. I am going to play this whole game in normal speed until I crash and burn. Uh, which will happen, and, and you will see it. There we go. We've begun. So, number one thing, figure out the mechanics. I was trying to figure out where these two guys were going. And they were building a stall in the marketplace. And I know it's a little thing, but learning how this game works, you know, pushing people, like uh, pick, clicking on a building and then you click on people and you see what they're doing. If, the, if they're working too far away, so actually I'd rather these guys be working uh, I don't know, can I uh, reassign right now? I don't know. So I can click on a house. So I'd rather these people work. So right now, these guys are working at the forestry, right? I'd rather these guys do it. Oh, maybe because they're not. Bread, freshly baked. Oh, I used, to f I used to remember there was a... Um yeah, there we go. Oh. Oh, I want to do this. Oh, because there's no one living in here. Right? Sorry! Alright, I'm really enjoying the mechanics of this game at the moment. Um, okay, so let's zoom out. I'm still using his uh, design. But we're building around here right now. And I gotta tell you, I really do like the way that my men are traveling. Uh, there is no huge pass that they're they're uh, missing everything's working out right now no complaints just none one thing I wanted to do too is press number X X X and just look at how my men just move Come along. I have two hitching posts of course I do and here we go we're going to have a lot more population now the problem is we got the food input the food input has to be increased enough that the extra population that you're going to get is going to be satisfied. And uh, right now we're looking good, we're looking good, and this is the fastest speed that you can play this game. I won't be doing it very long. And that's about good enough. Z, Z. Z, Z. So I'm hoping that the sound is better now. Um, I just like the way that this is working out right now so far. These are all houses and I got my uh, storage and granary over here. This is the, the middle and the, the market. I'm telling you, I'm liking what I'm seeing right now. With this. Yep, I'm still using that same, that same format. I just think this is good. I just think this is So this um, right here is the best camera angle I can get on my city so far. I'm telling you, this game is absolutely 